So it's kind of a shame. Um, I think a lot of times when we're dealing with people, um, we often will try to beat them to the hurt. And a lot of times that means we're gonna try to beat them to, I'm gonna hurt you before you hurt me. And even worse is I'm gonna hurt myself before you hurt me. Don't cut yourself if nobody's showing you a sharp object. Uh, because a lot of times we're doing that because it's our way of inadvertently saying, I'm not completely healed, I'm not ready, I'm not whole, whatever it is. And so therefore I see the inadequacies in myself and I'm gonna point them out before you point them out in me. And most of the time, if somebody's talking to you and you are a person of interest to them, they're not looking at that. They're not measuring you by that. So sometimes we gotta stop measuring ourselves by a standard that other people aren't. And I get it, sometimes we are, you know, well, not sometimes, most of the time we're our own worst critic. But what it also means is that we have to ease up on ourselves, give ourselves a little more grace and mercy when it comes to some of these ways that we continue to judge ourselves and almost put ourselves down in hopes that somebody else sees us as something to raise up like we have to we have to raise ourselves up we have to be that person for ourselves we can't rely on somebody else to do that what we want to be able to do is come into these circumstances as ourselves on our own energy we don't have to match somebody else's energy we come in on our own energy and if it's compatible with somebody else's energy then that's a great thing but if it's not then sometimes you just move on and that's okay too but what we don't want to do is throw ourselves at the mercy of people because who are we who are any of us to judge we can have our maybe not our standards but we have our preferences but it doesn't mean that we are out to or should be out to measure other people as not worthy and we certainly shouldn't be doing it to ourselves saying I'm not worthy if somebody's talking to you and giving you that attention accept it go into it wholeheartedly and just be the best version of yourself that you can and see where, it, see where it leads you. You never know. Some couples have probably made it in ways that they never thought that they would. And that's a great thing. That's a great place to be. So what are your thoughts on this? Um, I, know, I know you guys know what I'm talking about. And it's, it's often sad to see. We don't need to do that to ourselves. Um, and certainly don't do it to other people. Um, don't don't try to inflict the hurt to yourself or others even if you are hurt sometimes the best thing to do is just take take the take the lesson from it and move on and go heal yourself there's no there's no benefit to hurting people back but i guess that's also part of human nature but just my thoughts what are your thoughts ace up the sleeve advice comment experience would love to hear what you guys think on the matter and as always, subscriptions are free to the channel, so we'd love to have you here. And as always, I hope this finds everybody in your place, pursuit, or beginnings of total health, mind, body, and soul. Peace, love, unity, solidarity.